Okay, so here's the, um, sorry about the wind, can't do much about that, because I'm on the roof. Anyway, here's the inverted V. The rod is the pole I've had, it's a four, four and a half metre pole, with about a metre in the roof, maybe a bit more in the roof. So that goes up to where you can see that black cap. Then on top of that, I've got a mast, which is made for attaching to another mast. So that's probably, I don't know, two metres long, maybe a little bit more, two and a half. No, actually, I think they're three. But anyway, who gives a shit? There it is. Hard drawn copper, and that goes down to, there's a pole down that way. And the other one goes down that way to the fence. And while I'm up here, here you go. Don't have a look at the beam. It's only a baby. That's a um, Diamond X300, 2 and 70. This is a Cushcraft MA5B, 5 band, 3 element. Very good antenna. The boom is only two and a half metres long. The longest element is, I think it's 5.2 or something. So it's pretty small compared to, you know, the other stuff. And there's a rotator. And you can see there, one to one ballon which I've made, sits right underneath the beam there. And I'm putting one of those on the, uh, oh look, tower. Mm. Um, I'm putting one of those one to one ballons on the uh, inverted V, but it's gonna be in the roof. Um, because the reason I'm doing that, oh, i got to get over this guy wise. The reason I'm doing that is because I already had that long coax feeder already made and um, I've now got it running and I put the, I just set the uh, one to one ballon on the roof there and um, yeah it worked fine so I thought oh, I'll just get in the roof and put it in the roof instead of having it above there. Um, Something else you might be interested in. That there is a ubiquity 5.8 gig data link. Very nice, rather cheap. Links to my mate's place down there somewhere. Um, yeah, very nice link. So, there you go, boys and girls. Um, that's a tour of my roof. Yeah. Alright, 73s. Take it easy.